Hi everyone, it's Margaret here. It's so great to be back uh, after such a long pause. Um, as I stated on my um, Facebook page, uh, I've had some personal issues with family and um, I have been crafting a little bit at a time and uh, just putting the little projects away until I, I had time to film and here I am now. So I made some uh, soap sachets as I did in the past, but I kind of personalized them with uh, different little themes and I'll show you what I mean. Um, starting with this one. Um, this is a, a little uh, sewing themed one and uh, on the um, on the corner you can see there's a little banner that says sewing mends the soul and I've used a variety of different laces as you can see I won't go into any great detail um, and then there's this little image of um, this pretty little lady and she's sewing away and if you look really closely maybe you won't be able to see I've added a little tiny piece of, of silver thread that looks like a needle and a little little bit of thread that's hanging uh, hanging off of it uh, because I, I really love giving uh, the projects a little detail that your uh, eye can go to and um, and uh, really make things a little bit different so um, what I was saying um, because this is a sewing themed one, you can see also I've added a, a little bobbin with some pearls and um, um, a little thimble uh, with some pearls, painted them pink to match. But inside, there's another little bag inside, a little lace bag, and I won't take everything out, but um, I've added a few little sewing uh, tools in here, a tape measure, some thread, a little sewing kit, uh, a little uh, scissors, um, because not everybody needs a, a, a big sewing kit. Uh, this would be great for someone who's just getting married and, you know, just to give them a little something pretty to, um, you know, to start them off having a little uh, sewing kit of their own um, just when it's needed. So that's my little sewing one. And then the next one, um, I love this one. I love the pearls on it. Uh, this one is uh, Enchantment and Perfume. It's very feminine and very glamorous. Got this pretty little lady in the front and she's holding a mirror, uh, which I've embellished with some uh, gold filigree and uh, some crystals, some seam binding. And then it's got these little perfume bottle dangles uh, off, of, uh, off of the seam binding. And once again, um, uh, the ties are, uh, have little pearls on them, but once again inside, if you open the bag, there's another little bag that um, is lace, and inside this bag is a little embellished altered mirror, a little tiny mirror, and it's got the same picture of the same lady on the front, and I've just put some beautiful braid uh, trim all around, and it's a little mirror, as you can see, and that goes inside the little lace bag which goes inside the, the little pouch. So that's another idea. And then this is, uh, this is one, I had done one in the past called Kisses or A Thousand Kisses and I love this because again, um, it, uh, it gives a little uh, warm message uh, to the recipient or if you want to keep it yourself. Um, it's got a little girl blowing kisses and uh, again, pretty little uh, wedding dress um, dress and appliques, um, some dangle trim, and uh, again inside, if we open the bag, it's got a double um, double tie with lace and, and ribbon. Inside this one is a little sack of Kisses chocolate. So again, that makes a nice pretty little gift. It's a little different. So sending along some Kisses and some chocolate. And that's that one. Um, this one's really colorful, so I used um, a lot of pinks and mauves and um, greens. And this is called Flowers of Happiness. And you can see the image of the little lady. Um, she's got a little watering can and flower and watering her uh, her garden. Again, a cluster of uh, different uh, flowers and greenery. And um, I made this. I was looking forever for a little watering can to uh, to alter, but I couldn't find one the right size at the dollar store. So I actually made this one and uh, recovered it uh, in the same embellishments and colors as the. Uh, as the uh, the sack, and then again inside, uh, it's I've included a, a pink uh, lace bag, 
And inside, again, I won't take them out, but I've included some um, uh, packets of flower seeds. There's marigolds and um, uh, different types of flowers for the uh, gardener. And uh, again, I, that makes a really pretty Mother's Day gift or um, someone who, who loves to garden. And the next one, um, I love dolls, so I had to make one with uh, for a little dolly, and this is called Dolly and Me. And I love this little image of this little girl with her doll. I've added a little bow on her hair. And I love these colors. It's a fleshy, uh, vintage seam binding in the creams and the rose, a dusty rose. And I've added these vintage uh, tassels here, which I've embellished. And again, some vintage trims. The whole sack is made with a, with a vintage uh, doily. And again, a flower. And inside this one, again, is a little lace sack. And this one's really sweet. I love, I love her. Um, if you open up the bag, I included a little dolly, which I've uh, re, uh, redone. I've uh, put a little dress on her, and she is a little porcelain doll. So you can see that she's got a pretty little uh, vintage style dress the little buttons down the back and she's all decked out and pretty so she goes inside the little sack and for safekeeping and inside the uh, the little uh, little bag and the last one is just the regular soap sachet that I've made in the past and again I won't take it out but it has a beautiful uh, soap in, uh, soap box inside with these pretty little ladies in the front and uh, again some dangles and embellishments and crystals to make it all pretty and uh, even on the ties I've added these little trims and um, crystals and again that's uh, that's a nice uh, little gift again for uh, for anyone that's special to you. So these are my latest sacks, ladies. I hope you enjoyed watching this. Again, uh, welcome back to my channel. Thank you for your support. And uh, I'll be back again. I've made a other few projects, so I'll be back again to share those with you soon. Thank you for watching. Bye for now.